Hi, it's Julian Meller from PropperGolfing.com. In this video, I just want to show you how to make a very simple golf swing. I was watching um, the Dunhill Cup uh, just this weekend, and one of the commentators uh, was talking about Tyrrell Hatton's golf swing and how simple his golf swing looks and how e efficient and effective it is. So what I wanted to do is just kind of give you some hints and tips that could help you achieve a really simple golf swing. So the first thing you want to do is just get a spare golf club and stand nice and upright and all we're going to do is turn right and turn left so imagine if there was a golf ball here i can see the golf ball here but as i hit it then i turn left so when you're doing this there's six things that's happening so you're getting the turning of the body right and left if you're right-handed you're also learning to weight transfer so moving your weight efficiently through impact you'll also build up really good rhythm to this one what we would call coordination and balance and if we can do this in a relaxed way it's all going to work really well and help you achieve a very simple golf swing now just before I uh, add the next bit onto this one, if you are serious about your golf game and you really do want to improve, you should be signing up to propergolfing.com. In that, as soon as you join, you'll get instant access to hundreds of videos in the library section. You'll also get monthly coaching sessions with myself, as well as a weekly Zoom invite to a webinar that I host. So if you are serious about your golf game, you should be signing up to propergolfing.com. Now again, let's get back into this video. So, very simple drill all we're doing is turning right and turning left and if you do this efficiently and correctly you're already st you're on your uh, you know you're a long way towards making a very simple golf swing now we can't just go round turning right and turning left so what we need to do now is make this more realistic as though we were going to hit a golf ball so what I'm going to do is bend forward from my hips imagine I've got a, I've actually got a seven iron here so I'm going to bend forward enough to put me in a seven iron position and all I'm going to do now is turn right so I can see the golf ball in my backswing and then look forward. So we're really training our body to become very efficient at moving. Now the next thing that we need to do to, to really simplify this is if you imagine I was going to throw this golf club towards you. So all that's happened from here, my elbows have folded, my wrist has bent and now I could make a really simple throwing action. So what we want is this action sideways on. So if I turn to the side now, so I'm holding my golf club correctly. So I've done my little turn to the side and now I'm going to do the throwing action. So imagine now I was throwing this towards a camera back down to the golf ball and then if I do it on the follow through so I've turned I folded my arms correctly in the back swing and now I've folded them in the follow through so now I could do the throwing action again in the other direction so if I show you this from face on so the first movement is turn then we do the throwing action then we're back to the golf ball where we were when we started we're turning through and now we can do the throwing action in the other direction. So I'm going to do this in a very slow motion. So turn, wrists, through. So let's just do that again. Turn, turn. Now if you, if you can do this, which I have never seen anybody who can't do that movement, and if you could start to throw the club over your shoulder, it doesn't even matter if you can only get to this far back, you'll still be able to make a simple golf swing. So we turn, do the throw in action, and now I can do the throw in action. And this is the, the basis of making a very simple golf swing. Now, we could go round and we can hit the golf ball at that speed and we'll hit it quite nicely or we could add a little bit of speed where it matters. So the backswing would remain the same, still a really smooth backswing, but now on the way down, I just put a little bit of speed into it. So if you're struggling with your golf swing, have a go at these two very simple exercises. So this one and then the throwing action Put them together and you're going to end up with a really simple golf swing so i'd love to hear how you get on with this one if you want to leave some comments in the box below please do so and i'll happily answer them as soon as possible thanks for watching bye